Westcott and I am the head brewer at Barnhammer Brewing Company. I got involved with, uh, with Barnhammer, must have been starting about three to four years ago. We, uh, I, was, I was living in Edmonton, but my, my wife and I, we were planning to move to Winnipeg at some point. So I came here looking to see what was going on with the brewing industry and, and just kind of got in touch with Tyler who was just looking into starting a brewery. Tyler kind of does everything to the extreme eventually. It started out with just home brewing, just regular equipment and then he started buying more intense um, like commercial grade small batch equipment and uh, he actually like brewed a few beers uh, for our wedding so we had that at our wedding. People really loved it. Um, then he kind of saw that the laws were changing for, uh, for having, uh, so that tap rooms could be part of breweries, because before it was just, you could only have a brewery and not have an actual space where people could drink the beer. The name came from just uh, Tyler's cabin at the lake, um, is on a farmland, and there's a, there's a big barn on the farmland, and um, one weekend his dad decided he was going to pull the barn down, um, but he was by himself there and then he rigged up his Dodge Journey and um, to the barn to pull it down and it didn't work. Uh, and then the next weekend we went to the cabin and when we arrived it was just kind of tilted and he told us that he tried to pull it down with the Dodge Journey and then we just started calling his car the Barn Hammer. You'll see people come in, they've, they've been to Half Pines to get a growler, they're going to come here to get another growler, they might go to somewhere else. People tend to move around, they're not just going to one place over and over again, which is kind of is what sort of craft beer is all about. Yeah, that word comes up a lot, competition. Um, I don't feel like it's competition, it's definitely a community. We've ran out of caps for our growlers before, called Half Pints. They say, yep, no problem, come grab a bag. Um, we've borrowed equipment, we've had equipment borrowed from us. In a way, you're also, all the, all the smaller breweries are definitely working to kind of get some market share from, um, from the bigger breweries. The idea isn't to try and take that from each other, you were trying to take a little bit of a chunk out of uh, the bigger industry. It's exciting. Everyone seems to really pump each other up.